Hey there, it's Brittany, and I'm back with the September Magical Mystery Bead Box. I am so excited about this um, because I had a little peek. I shouldn't have done it, but I, I don't really know what's in here, but I peeked and saw one strand, and it was gorgeous. So I'm so excited to show you what's in here. So here is the card. What does it say? Morticia's Garden. Oh, September 2021. That's a cool card. I love her ring and her nails. Art credit, Scarlet Gothica. That's cool. That's awesome. Okay, so what's growing? Bead strands, uh, bead strand and spells and hexes. Inspiration bead mix in Morticia's Garden. Bead mix in Seance in the Gazebo. Bead mix in Eternally Yours. Darling, I always wear black earring components. Midnight snack bead mix. Flora and Fauna. Um, metal mix. Chain reaction. Soft flex amethyst wire very cool and then it's got all their their other stuff i like the art this month they always have a really cool card so let's see what's in the box so first i'm seeing the soft flex and i've actually used this on a project before um i love the colored wire purple amethyst color and then so i'm gonna turn this over so I see that there, it says chain reaction. So let me find the chain reaction. Ooh, nice like mystic purple color. Very nice. I like the little diamonds. I gotta do something. I have so much chain reaction. I gotta do something with um, with it other than using it as chain. So we'll come up with some ideas together. <laughs> um, Okay, so this is the thing that I saw by accident. Well, not by accident, I actually I opened it up, but uh, this is the only thing I saw and it's so awesome. So it's called Spells and Hexes and it's the bead strand. And look at this, it's just, it's like all metal. It's not like actual all metal, but it looks all metal. And I just bought some beads that some of these would really go well with. Like, look at that big metal bead, there's two of them. There's a crown on there, there's some crystals got some metal hishi beads um look at this one right here that's really cool this is a cool cool strand I want like 10 of them <laughs> that's what happens when I see something that I really like I'm like I need all of them all of the ones that are in existence I need them it's the bead hoarder in me I really love this I really love this um let's see midnight snack oh what's this so it says Midnight Snack Bead Mix. I'm seeing some wings in there. Let's look at that. These are so cool. They're like resin wings. And I can't tell if they're like real wings that people or that somebody put resin on or if they're like acetate wings. But they're so cool. I love them. They are a purpley blue, so they go from like blue down into purple. I love the little gold flecks. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. This is a really, really cool piece. Um, I don't know that I would just turn them into earrings. I mean, that's the easy thing to do and they would look fantastic, but I, I kind of see them on a pendant necklace. And then, <laughs> look, Venus flytrap earrings. I don't have any fly traps, but I love plants. Like I'm obsessed with plants just as much as I am with Goldie and beads. And well, maybe a little bit less than Goldie and beads, but it's up there. And this is amazing. I don't know what I'm going to do with these, but I love them so, so much. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. All right. So next we have, um, what do we have in here? We have darling. I always wear black. Oh, these are cool keep saying these are cool but everything's so awesome and yes it's like Halloween colors but it's not specifically Halloween so if you don't celebrate you can always use purple and black and green that's for sure not a lot of not everybody's wild about Halloween but this isn't specifically Halloween like some of the other mixes out there this is awesome look at these I love these and yes it is killing me that I don't wear earrings because I want to wear these look at the lotus look how detailed Look at the lotus flower on them. Wow. And like the Greek key around the sides. These are cool. I love those. 
so that's the darling I always wear black <laughs> such a cool funny name um, then we have seance in the gazebo let's see what's going on here I'll go, I need to get a, um, a bead cup or a bead tray Okay, so look at this big bad boy right there. It's like a big crystal ball filled with gems. I think that's pretty cool. You see these sometimes with the smaller size, but I've never seen one that big. That is so neat. Sorry, there's like a glare from my light, but it's so cool. I see this hanging with like a maybe the wings and like um some leather or some fairy silk or something i i have like an idea like huge pendant necklace with those and let's see what's in this mix so oh my gosh look at these they have like the best metal i swear so we've got really neat um, okay, so this is you can string this two different ways. You can go that way as a teardrop or that way almost as a briolette, but it's like halfway through. That is really cool. That is really cool. So this one you can see kind of like the seed husks. They use that to um to uh like not sand, but like um well it's kind of sandy. I don't know how to explain it. So like if you think of beads or candy or something going around and around in like a drum to coat them or to it's really just to soften the edges that's what those are and they just don't this these didn't come out very well in the process so you can pick those out they'll fall out by themselves eventually um then we have some little acrylic flowers i used these on those big statement earrings last month I love those. I love that they're black with the iridescence or the AB on them. We've got some matte gold crystals. Very cool. Um, oh, these are neat little skeletons, but they're hematite and they're rainbow. They're like that oil slick or m majestic vitriol color. Love those. Um, we've got some matte printed beads like etched beads I love these these are so cool I think these were in a different mix too if not they were similar oh so cool. look at this color palette like it's like eerie like greens and blues and metallics I'm loving it oh my goodness so there's are there four of the skulls yeah that's cool this is a neat little mix oh my goodness and then we've got some table cut beads We've got some rubber coated beads. We've got some coated um, glass beads. So when I say coated, it means that there's a coating on the outside of the bead um, that makes it that color. So actually, are these half coated? Mm, I can't tell. I think they're half metallic and then just half purple. Then we have, oh look at these little guys. I love them. Uh, I don't have any like that color or that size. That's pretty cool. I love those. This is a really great box. I've been saying that every month though, like this whole year. I, I have not had a box that disappointed me. And that's that's great. Uh, they really took the, the feedback. <laughs> I mean, we were hard on them and you can just tell like they cared enough for us to, or for them to like take the feedback, put it into use. And you can see it's just really well developed box. Um, and we have some antique brass metal in two different shapes. Very cool. Very happy with that mix. It was a little a smaller mix, but like, I mean like smaller beads. But we did have some larger ones, those and then the big crystal ball. Like this guy's cool. That is really, really neat. I'd want to do something like make a base or something out of polymer clay. I don't even know how I would do that. <laughs> um, and then we have a few more things in here. So we have the flora and fauna. Oh my gosh. It's a little creepy. I'm going to have to get over my phobia. Oh my. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. So what do we have in here? We have a big spider. 
that's a big one. He's a little creepy, but I like it. Like, that's a great statement piece. Can hit glue him onto there. He's really creepy, but I like it. Oh my gosh, look at this little enamel but butterfly. The little skulls, and then you can see the vertebrae from the butterfly. Although, the butterflies don't have vertebrae, but you know what I mean. <laughs> At least I don't think they do. If they do, please correct me. Um, oh, I love it. Sna snakes are like, I don't like snakes like in person, but I do ha like how they look like in jewelry stuff. Like if I saw a snake outside, because I do live in Arizona, I would lose my mind. But in jewelry stuff, it's okay. I like those. Oh, we have really spooky spooky scary looking spiders oh my goodness Ooh, get the willies <laughs> and then we have some bead caps those are cool they kind of look like those um they're like pointier oh and then we have like some little flowers those are cool and then we have a softer looking bead cap and then we have some little spacer flowers so neat. I love that it was all like just metal in that mix. Um, oh my gosh, we still have two more mixes in here. Oh my goodness. And um, wow, they both look amazing. Okay, so the one's colorful and one's not. So I'm going to go through the one that's not first. This one's called Eternally Yours. And what did it say on here? Bead mix and Eternally Yours. Okay. I don't want to there we go and then the shreds were black this month and not pink <laughs> isn't that great black and purple this month all right so what's in here <gasps> look at this amazing big big black flower bead so cool so cool like when I was making jewelry to sell like this kit would have been the kit of my dreams because I could have I just would have made so much cool stuff to sell now I gotta just find time to make it for the for the channel <laughs> um okay these are neat they are these are not bendable but they're 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 like rubber coated petals in black and two different sizes so we've got the bigger size and the smaller size these are so cool I already have an idea for those Oh my goodness, I love this box. And then, are these, well, it looked, oh, it's not too hold. There's just a little bit of a damage on the point there. But um, if you wire wrap that, you wouldn't even be able to see that. But these are a really neat shape. <gasps> Look at these. That's neat. I'm loving like the new, like, yes, we have some of the staples, like the chain, um, the baubles, but I'm loving like some of the new bead um, shapes that they're expanding into. Um, and then we have some cr uh, black, or I'm sorry, pur dark purple crystals. We did get some of these in one of the Halloween mixes, but I'm loving it. I love those. I can use those in conjunction with the other ones that I already have. <gasps> Look at these flowers. Aren't those gorgeous? You don't have to keep it creepy. Like you can make it really pretty. You, if you, I mean, I think they're already pretty, but, um, doesn't have to be creepy. You know what I mean? Like it doesn't have to just be Halloween. This is the coolest box. Like <clears throat> there have some been some really, really awesome boxes this year. And one of them that sticks out in my mind was the desert box, um, the fairy box, the bohemian box. Last month I really liked the box, but it wasn't my style because of the colors, but I still really liked it. But like this one I think is my favorite so far which is I said that several times this year and it's just crazy that I keep I'm keep being able to say that look at those O M G those are some funky hands I love it I love it those are so cool I wonder if I can find like a glass bead that I could glue to this the center that would look like a crystal ball That'd be so cool. And then we've got two of the gunmetal roses with some crystals on the inside. Oh my gosh, that mix. I like, so far that mix and this mix, this strand are my favorites, but I, oh, 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 oh. And these, I can't forget about these. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I, love, I love this box. I know you guys are like, God, Brittany, move on. <laughs> okay, and then last, 
but certainly not least we have um what's this uh morticia's garden no bean mix say is this sands in the gazebo no we already we already looked at that one uh oh no inspiration bead mix in morticia's garden okay okay sorry gotta get my stuff together here so we'll open this up i haven't seen one in in this kind of box in a while this is usually like the box that they sell at walmart or joann's or something like that so it's interesting to see it again okay so what do we have in here what's this thing it's a mushroom that's cool i guess that's the new thing fungi are in right now and i because you see them everywhere but that's pretty cool it's got a nice enameled cap oh these are gorgeous these are again the metal with the rubber coating beautiful flowers love those little pansies oh look at these look at the i don't you can't tell but this is like super purple, but it's a clear, it's a clear flower with a really nice AB. Like maybe it's a yellow. No, it's clear. But the AB on it is so amazing and so well done. It's like looking at something that's UV, like UV colors without a UV light. Oh, love them. Okay. So what else do we have in here? We have some, not, I'm sorry. They're not acrylic. They're crystals love that the purple pink yellow red we've got some like green gold rubber beads well they're acrylic beads with rubber coating then we've got some sheriff stars that's what i call them at least we've got some wavy like potato chip spacers we've got some square crystals some of my favorite coating on those um, some uh, matte pink beads I think those are dyed oh look at these oh there's two of them there some nice bead caps those could be really cool witches hats if you painted them or you can leave them that color too um, two more bead caps Uh, another crystal shape. I love this shape. I saw this in something else recently and I was like, what shape is that? What shape is that? Guy? <laughs> two hexagons. Two teardrops. These are hefty. Those are big boys. And look at the striations in there. That is so cool. Those are gorgeous. Um, some acrylic beads. Some acrylic flowers. Gorgeous and two big boy crystals oh mg like i said this is this is hands down my favorite box this year which is crazy because i've said that so many times and I, there are still three months left in the in the year october november december i cannot wait to see what they come up with like i literally can't wait to see what they come up with okay so what are my favorite things this for sure this strand is just out of this world i love it so much okay then um these these hands um oh the venus fly traps this and um the wings yeah those are my favorites my goodness great job jesse james beads i gotta say i am in love with this box i gotta like sort it because i just messed everything up but <laughs> it was so fantastic tell me what you would make with some of these things i like my brain is like bursting right now with ideas and that's the problem like i get too many ideas and then i can't do any of them so i think a lot of us are in the same boat um i shared a picture in my facebook group of my desk and everybody's like yep that's exactly what my desk looks like. <laughs> so, but let me know what, what was your favorite part of this? What, what would you do with some of these things? I just am pleased as punch that it's not specifically Halloween, but it can be used that way. And that they use some non-traditional colors for, for this time of the year. So way to go, Jesse James Beats. Love it. Keep up the good work. Um, 
Stay tuned for Goldie. She's super cute. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll leave links below. Um, their affiliate links to Jesse James Bead so you can subscribe to their box if you're interested. Have a good rest of your day. Bye bye. Hi. Hi. You want, you're trying to get some tummy rubs out of this, aren't you? You're the good girl. Yes, you're such a sweetie. Look at that little face. Hi, cutie. Hi. How you doing? Just hanging out. Where'd you get this tummy? Where'd that tummy come from, huh? Hi, baby. Hi, cutie baby. Yeah. Just hanging out and then mom pushes a camera in your face. It's like the paparazzi. Everybody loves you, Goldie. Yeah. Everybody loves you. <laughs> He's so cute.